I'm in Christophe Santi's exhibition, Le Grand Bouffe, which means the great feast. And this exhibition is a riot of colour and joy. And I think the reason this theme of food is so appealing is because it's so universal. We encounter food in our daily lives, we can't avoid it. But yet, Christophe Santi has done something very special with it. He's turned these everyday items into something monumental, iconic, giving them new focus in unexpected ways. In this scene, we see a fish stool, which is very reminiscent of the types of stools that Christophe Santi sees around his hometown of Ostend, which is by the sea. But it's not a specific image, and in fact, what Santi's doing is drawing imagery from all over the place. He's drawing imagery from books, from objects he's collected, knickknacks he's found. One of the things that I love is that he's not afraid to bring humour into his work or for people to interpret humour into his work. Santi works with a medium of oil paint and a painting like this really shows just how many ways in which he is able to use that. We see him constantly scraping adding more, subtracting. He's also doing very interesting things as well, using linoleum print to create this lovely pattern along the boat, and even scratching into the paint. You can see these little hearts and the way he's counting these numbers here. And these are things that you don't see far away, but as soon as you come up to close to the painting, all of these different details unfold. One of the really interesting things about Santi's work is the way he layers his paints and he often reuses canvases and here we can even see the remnants of uh, an earlier painting, the texture that's underneath the glass and what I really like about this work is that he's not afraid of that, he lets that texture show through and it's part of the history of the painting. Santi likes to avoid narrative in his paintings and consequently there's something almost mysterious about this work. We've got this mysterious woman here but her face is constructed in the most simplistic of details. In fact the dog's been given more attention than the woman and here we have the butcher whose face is covered up entirely. Santi's really trying to focus our work on colour and pattern and texture. The figures are almost incidental. Santi is able to give everyday objects a sense of monumentality and presence. 